Uh, of course, we do need to mention that uh, unfortunately in this match, Isa Molde yes. got injured. Fortunately, apparently, but behind the serious yeah, injury. Yes, that's true. And they're saying also that it's not that serious. Although an injury is still an injury. Yeah. No, yes. we just need to wait for her to recover and be better. But if she's somebody like uh, Des Cheng, then her comeback is something that we are very excited about also. And we pray for Isa Molde. But more so, we're, we're talking about um, the rest of the UP players as well. They tried to step up in the second set and the third set but Phil mentioned nga na it was quite demoralizing how they lost the ba yes and I I saw the first set Nikita they 14 all 16 all and in the end lang breaks of the game the errors gave them um gave them out na it, it gave the win to Ateneo yung service error and spike na outside yung nakapanalo sa Ateneo and for UP to fight so strong in the first set and to lose it nakakahina talaga ng loob and in the second set yung nga si Isa Molde 4-0 pa lang beginning of the second set and she got injured now but i think i i just read now it's just it was just a sprain so we we're praying for isa yes. molde for her fast recovery then of course we don't want any player to get injured yeah we want to yes. see isa yeah. molde back on the court and i'm sure that's what the up fans are praying for thank you for watching the score don't forget to subscribe to abs-cbn sports youtube channel to be updated with the latest games